Hello guys. So till now we have done a building and went for its analysis. So our building was basically a frame structure for which we uh, first we defined the nodes, then we joined to form the beams, then we went for translational repeat for a number of floors because it was a typical building, and then uh, we ended up by giving the load cases. So the whole process of drawing the building was the longest process. So STAD has a way of doing these things in a much simpler way. So we are going to learn that. So for that, this is especially for particular typical frames like the bay frame and all uh, that we generally use. So the STAD has a way of doing for that, uh, a easier way of doing that. For that, we need to go to geometry, then uh, go for this run structure wizard. So by doing this, we'll see there are certain truss models, We'll go for frame models because we are for the frame, bay frame, grid frame, floor grid. There are various stuffs. We'll go for bay frame and double click on this. After double clicking, uh, it will ask us for the length, the height, the width. Fine. So let it be the length be 12 meter, height be 15 meter, width be 12 meter. And along length, we'll give different numbers. Two, this is three, and this is four to make you understand what is length, what is height, and what is width. Mark these numbers. Apply. So see, we gave two along length. So this is the length part. See, we have two spans. Along height, we gave three. So one, two, three. We have three spans. Along uh, width, we gave four. So one, two, three, four. Four spans are there. So after this, we can go for transfer model. Yes. So this thing is for uh, placing the thing at a particular node if the node is already existing. Uh, because we don't have any node existing, we'll go for the 000 base. Okay. So sweet. Just see, uh, the whole building is there. Our whole building, the whole uh, structure, we are having it here. Just see. So now the thing becomes very easy. If we are going for say assigning of uh, supports, then we can directly go to general supports, say support, use cursing to assign, uh, assign, we can select this whole stuffs, and then assign, we can assign it directly like this. Uh, let's see, you can assign it very easy. It becomes very easy. The whole thing becomes very, very easy. Just see, our whole building becomes okay. Then we go on assigning it one by one by one. Otherwise, you can directly select them and go to assign. So that is also an easier way. But uh, in this way, just see, our whole building has been assigned. Within two minutes, we are able to do the whole frame structure assign supports everything but the only problem is that if we have a non-typical section say we don't have this beam here we have this beam little bit here or there then you have to go for that one manually there is no other way but uh, again if you have a differences on a particular floor or one or two floor uh, most of them most of the things typical say 10 floors typical and top two floors are different because for the pool house and all then uh, you can go for the section you can cut out that section, you can edit it, edit that and then uh, again proceed. Uh, for those sections, there are already videos for that, you can refer to that. So with this, uh, we are closing. Thank you.